Hey y'all. How y'all doing? Alright. Dustin, back for another video. Um, not gonna be doing too much today. I, I'm still a little sore from yesterday. Went out yesterday, helped my buddy Zach. My bro Zach. And, um, helped him with yard work. We did a lot of yard work yesterday. Busted our ass. Uh, cut grass, mostly. Um, raked pine straw, shoveled rocks. <clears throat> shoveled rocks. Sorry, I don't know why my voice is acting up. Um, shoveled rocks. Uh, yeah, whatnot. Got done. Went uh, hibachi out for lunch. Not the Mr. Hibachi's for lunch. Got back and um, finished up. And then took a break and then left and went to the cigar shop and uh, had a few cigars um, had a couple of cigars and uh, smoked and I haven't been in Kingston cigar shop in a while it's been about a year since I've been there and they've changed a lot and uh, they changed a lot since I've been in there and um Yeah, yeah, yeah. They changed a lot. When I went in there, they moved. They made it more. They put more room in the place. Um, there's more room to move around. They got a bunch of new brands of cigars out. Um, I've I've had one. I had one of them. One of the new brands. It's a five dollar cigar. It was real real big. It was like it's like that big. And um, it was a uh, chillin' moose cigar. Had the moose head on it, and um, had the moose head on it. And uh, what was that? Oh, anyway, um, it was a good cigar. It was a mild smoke, uh, kind of woodsy taste. Had a, had a wood taste to it, but it was it was really good. Um, my bro Zach had a Vegafina. He was smoking a Vegafina. I mean, him were just chilling in there. They had they have a pool table. They got two flat screen TVs in there, two big ones, and we we're sitting on the pool table chilling. And um, we were uh, we weren't sitting on the pool table. I'm I'm tired as tired. Um, we were we were chilling. We were chilling, playing pool. I'm sorry if this video is messing up for y'all, but uh, anyways. Yeah, I can't get my shit together. Um, yeah, we had fun at Cigar Shop. And so today, I'm going to be showing y'all a few things. Um, the dip I used to do, now, this was, I think, seven years ago. The dip I used to do, when they quit selling my Copenhagen Whiskey Blend, um, a while back, when they quit selling that, I couldn't when I couldn't find it anywhere else. The dip, the only dip I touched, and mostly did. Yes, sir. The welfare bear, as Mud Joe says, as Darcy says, Grizzly straight. I did Grizzly Premium straight, and it was the only dip I touched. Now, this can's empty. There ain't nothing in it. Hey, ain't nothing in it. So yeah, yeah so. So, yeah. Ain't nothing in it. It's empty. So. Yes, I know how to pack. Still. Since it's been that long. And the dip that most of my friends do. Um, the dip, I I do not like it. I It's too strong. And it's, it's disgusting to me. It tastes nasty. The dip is most famous is this dip. Grizzly Wintergreen, the premium Wintergreen. Now, most of my friends, they do these, they do the Grizzly Premium Wintergreen, and then they do the Grizzly Dark Wintergreen. So, this is this is the most famous dip right here. And this, I, I hated so much. This was my first dip I tried in my life, and then I went to Copenhagen Whiskey after this. So yeah, but yeah, those are the two. Those are the two dips. Um, that 
yeah, those are the two dips I did. The Copenhagen Whiskey Blend and the Grizzly Straight. Those are the most most two I did. So yeah. Um before I go, uh let's see. Oh yeah. I wanna do a shout out to that dipping girl. I think you're really cute. I think you're you're really good looking. <laughs> From my point of view, I'm gonna do a shout out to you. I appreciate you doing that Grizzly Straight video because it made it bring back, it brought back the memories for when I did it. Um, I thank you so much for that video. I really do. Um, do a shout out to you. Um, do a shout out to my bro Zach, my brother Zach, and uh, my bro Trey and the Tobacco Lads. Tobacco Lads are coming back, man, with videos. Yes, they are. Yes, we are. <laughs> um, do a shout out to the Tobacco Lads. Do a shout out to Mud Jug One. Shout out to Outlaw. Do a, um, let's see, what other shout outs I got? Shout out to uh, I don't think I know. I don't know too much. I'm slow as hell. My brain is acting up today. I don't know what's wrong with me. My apple juice here. Get that vitamin C. Um. Yeah, those are all my shout outs. Shout out to my bro Cameron. Keep it, keep it real, Cam. Keep it, keep your truck going. You know what I'm saying? Keep your truck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, my bro Zach. I love him to death. It's really cool to hang out with. We've been hanging out since freshman and sophomore year, so I love you to death, bro. Um, and uh, my bro Trey, love you to death too, man. I love hanging out with you and doing the videos of the tobacco lads. Do a shout out to Devin too, Devin who's with us on the tobacco lads. Y'all might have seen him in the, one of the videos, our special guest, one that Trey did, him and Devin did. Yeah, do a shout out to to all y'all, all y'all. All right, well, all right. One last thing, real quick before I go. Yes, sir. Any Pantera fans out there? I know I am. I'm a big Pantera fan. Black Tooth Grin, shot glass, lights up. All right. Y'all know what this is. I know y'all know what this is. I wear it almost every, every chance I get. I don't forget about it. That's right. Got mine. Dime bag razor. That's right. Dime bag razor necklace. I wear it almost all the time. Rita Haney, I thank you so much. I love you. You're awesome. With DimeBagHardware.com, check out all y'all out there who are Pantera fans or anybody who doesn't know. Get your gear, you know, shot glass. You get a free poster with it too. I'll show y'all the poster real quick. 